Hey everybody, it's Marina, and today I just wanted to do a quick video sharing with you guys how I store my pens in three different ways. Hey everybody and welcome to winter and the artificial lighting season. <laughs> so first of all, the first way that I store my pens, or just my black pens in general, the ones that I carry with me all the time, a little pen loop made out of uh, elastic and a binder clip. Super simple. And uh, that's, the, that's the pen that I have with me all the time. Generally when I do bullet journaling, I just have one black pen in my purse with me and it's generally this one and maybe a backup. And that brings me to my second way of storing pens, which is with a jar! Pretty simple. So this is just, once again, for black pens, sometimes like a fatter one, like um, a Tombow that's black or a dark gray. Um, pencils, you know, calligraphy sharpies. Um, this is a really good solution for next to the couch when I do my bullet journaling in the afternoon. So that works really well for that, because I still use those kind of on a daily basis. Um, but it's not necessarily when I'm out and about doing stuff. So the third way that I store my pens is in kablam! Okay, so this bad boy is essentially a like doctor's style bag. So it's got the zipper here and then it pops up, which is magnificent because then you can see the full array of all of the pens you have and they're consistently stored horizontally. So you don't need to worry about, you know, the ink bleeding to one end or the other. Um, I found this at a thrift store. Unfortunately, I can't, I can't find anything like it, so uh, just keep your guy keep your eyes open for something like that. It's just like a tall, kind of doctor style opening bag. It's really awesome, and I also really like that it's gold on the inside, so it reflects the light, so it's not just uh, like a dark pit of pens. Um, but I found this, and I just wanted to share it with you guys because you know I've had all these pen bags where. You either need to zip an entire top off and then fold it off, or you know, you zip just a small little zipper and then you have to like just shimmy your pens out. And it's always been super difficult for me, but this is like the perfect solution. It's all wide, everything's visible, really easy. It stores down really small and it's, it's got a zipper, so it's super easy to carry around and everything stays contained. It's just a really cool item, and I wanted to share that with you guys. So I, know, yeah, once again, uh, I know it's not going to be easy to find, but if you ever find anything like that, pick it up because it is perfect for pens. So this bag contains all of the colors and like double-sided tapes that I use in my monthly setups. Every once in a while, I will grab a pen out of here for um, if I do decide to do like a time tracker or make a colored weekly spread, I will steal them out of here. But once again, I don't need to carry those all around with me all the time because I mainly just do monochrome spreads. I also store a mini ruler and some pencils and some whiteout in here. So just the basic, you know, bullet journaling essentials. So there you have it. Those are the three ways that I store my pens. Pretty simple, but hopefully at least one of those was helpful to you guys. Like up this video if you like Mrs. Renfro's salsa, because I really do. Shout out to Mrs. Renfro's. And I hope to see you guys next week. Thanks for watching. Bye.